Leon here, back for another video, and today I wanted to talk to you about um, a better way to stretch your chest muscles, okay? So uh, if you're having a forward head posture, a rounded uh, shoulder kind of posture, one of the exercises, one of the stretches that you need to do is to stretch out your chest muscles. Specifically, you have your pectoralis major muscle as well as your uh, pectoralis minor, which is underneath it, and really hard to get at that smaller muscle. But uh, either way, you need to stretch these muscles out in order for you to fix your posture and bring your shoulders back, because a lot of people get really tight um, uh, chest muscles from sitting down in, in this position all day, right? So uh, one, typically, one of the stretches that's being given out there is the door frame stretch, which is this one here. You're going to place your arm at a 90 degree angle, you can even step through and, and kind of try to hold that. But in my opinion, this stretch is not that great, and I don't feel much of a stretch. Um, so I'm going to give you an alternative right now, another way to do it. And uh, here's what I'm going to suggest to you. Try this at home. What you want to do is place your arm under, uh, uh, kind of like at your waist level or hip level, OK? And then you're going to step out quite a bit in front, and then you're going to stretch up, keep your shoulders down, obviously. And I can feel it a lot more here. You can even extend your arms fully so that they're straight. And for me, this works a lot better than your typical 90-degree uh, door frame stretch like this, yes? So again, place your arm like just uh, underneath, kind of like uh, waist hip level. And then you want to look straight ahead. And then you want to push forward slightly. Now, I'm also extending forward quite a bit here. Yeah? So you don't want to just stay in one spot and kind of hang out here. You're not going to feel anything. Okay? So you want to, I'm using the back of my foot to really push myself. Yeah? It's coming from my calf muscle, my right leg now, to push myself forward. And then I'm really getting a nice extension here yeah? on both sides. And this is, a, for me, this is a better stretch, uh, better door frame stretch than your uh, uh, normal one that you know, usually people recommend. And this gets a lot more of a stretch in, in the chest muscles. Now, you want to make sure, check to see that your shoulders are not creeping up like this, okay? So this would be wrong, okay? If you're doing it like that, it's not going to be effective. And you want to keep your abs uh, pulled in a little bit. So if you're bringing your, your stomach out like this, Again, not going to be effective. So pull in your ab muscles a little bit, bring your shoulders down, stretch your spine up, look straight, and then extend forward, and then push from your back leg forward to get even a deeper stretch. And then you want to hold it for 30 seconds and do three sets. Yeah, you can even switch legs, because you are pushing from that back leg to move forward. So maybe if, if you, one of your legs get tired, uh, you can switch legs. And now, again, you're just pushing forward. 30 seconds. And I find that this is a better way to target uh, your chest muscles, uh, to stretch them out. So try it out for yourself. And let me know if you're feeling the stretch more than the regular door frame stretch. I'd love to hear from you. You can leave a comment below and let me know. Obviously, there's many different stretches out there and techniques. So what works for one person may not work for another. But I'd love to hear if this alternative uh, stretch to the door frame uh, helped you.